Mute. Bob Anthony says today might not be as bad as yesterday. But first, we're going to check in with Kelsey McFarland. She has her eye on the roads out there. She's by the connector. Kelsey. Well, Brian Kelsey, there's a really light mixture of rain and snow falling right now. You probably can't even see it. It's a really minor amount, and there could be sections of patchy fog this morning. But if you take a look at the I-84, most of that is just wet pavement on the highway there. And hopefully those temperatures don't drop so that the that wet mixture won't freeze. But yesterday, with those slippery conditions, Ada County saw a total of 40 crashes with six injuries. Now, three of those were rollover crashes. With similar slippery conditions this morning, be sure to just leave that extra time for your commute. Yesterday on the highway, speeds were around 35 miles per hour around 7 a.m. Now, so far this morning, we've heard of one crash in Nampa and one in Ada County, but they have been minor and no injuries reported. Those major roads again and highways will be mostly wet, but be cautious on those less traveled and rural areas. Now, as so far, there haven't been many crashes reported, but yesterday the majority of those crashes ha crashes happened around rush hour 7 a.m. Live in Boise, Kelsey McFarland, KBY2 News. All right, thank you, Kelsey, for that live report. Doesn't look too bad out there as bad as yesterday. But again, that snow is back. It was snowing this morning on my way in. How long will that last? Uh, it's already winding down. You can clearly see that on Doppler radar moving from northwest to southeast. Snow showers winding down the Boise area. Still some going just to our southeast, just a thin little band there. But for the most part, the show is over. Winter weather advisories were allowed to expire about 1.30 this morning for the Boise area and to our south about 5 a.m. Still going in eastern Idaho, though, and that includes the Burley area until 11 o'clock this morning. Mainly some wet roads out there, but we're watching that temperature very closely and also our cloud cover 32 degrees our current temperature. Here's our bus stop Benny forecast looking at cloudy skies and turning partly cloudy in the afternoon. Winter coat weather more on our forecast coming up. All right, thanks, Bob. And if you're seeing some snow in your area, we'd love to see your pictures. You can share them on our Facebook page or tweet them to us. If you do, you might see them on our air or on our websites. Here's a picture, for example, of Bogus Basin. This was actually taken by our production manager, Nick, who was getting a little playtime in after work yesterday. He snapped this pic last night. There's no shortage of snow up there. Bob will have the full ski report later on this morning.